Well, hello everybody. JT Bear here. Seventh week of fall. We've had our first official snowfall at my level. Figured we'd take a look inside the greenhouse, see how it's doing. Let's start with these. I decided to winter my peppers in the greenhouse instead of throwing them down in the dungeon because, well, the dungeon's just creepy and scary. There's all kinds of spiders in that crawl space. I, I don't really want to be down there. And I figured, what the heck, see how they do, give them a little bit more sunlight. I'm glad I did. Turns out I've got a bit of a pepper harvest to do today. Here we've got some of those red pearl onions that I planted, and of course I've always got the leeks on the go. A little willow tree's not looking too well, but it is zero in here. Let's take a look at the aquaponics. Over here I've got some stevia that I cut down and expected it to die, but it's been pretty stubborn. Stayed alive until now, but as you can see from the browning on the leaves there, it's starting to get just a bit too cold. My mint stubbornly growing away. Very pleased with how well this cat mint is doing. It's kind of sprawled out, taking over its little section, which is just fine. I need something to filter the nitrates. This kale's doing just fine in this cold. That's a good stiff leaf. I'm very happy with that. Oregano, as always. Now here's a kohlrabi that I've been growing for the last, I don't know, few months. And, uh, I gotta say, I'm pretty impressed with how well that's doing. Gonna have to harvest that soon. Over here, I've got a little bit of a broccoli that, uh, I broke off of one that was in the garden. Decided to plunk it into the aquaponics. We'll see what happens with that. Over here in the other bed, we've got that lemon balm that I transplanted from the raft bed. As you can see, some of it's not doing very well. I've got some browning going on there, but the rest of it, much like the cat mint, is just happily kind of taking over that corner, which is just fine. As always, I've got some shard going. Rosemary in the back doing just fine. And the sage. Decided not to harvest that this October. I was going to, but... I figure, what the heck, I'll just let that grow. I finally see Miles the turtle there for a change. Surprisingly, this cayenne pepper bush has not completely died off. Once again, I find myself with a few more random peppers to harvest today. That'll be nice, fresh peppers in November. Very nice indeed. You kind of get some idea of just how many pepper plants I was hoping to winter this year. Quite a few of them surprisingly do have fruit. And what's really interesting, here you can see some of the pepper plants are even trying to make new peppers as we go through the winter. So I'll be very curious to see what happens with that. But there you go, November 17th, basically week 7 of fall, first snowfall outside, zero degrees, if that focuses in. Things are still going, the fish are moving kind of slow, but they're doing okay. Alright, thanks for watching, have yourselves a great day.